Secrets, WahhabiKing.com, and we've got some awesome power distribution boards we're going to talk about today. Let's go ahead and start with the little one. Now, this is a micro power distribution board, and it was mainly designed for smaller quads in mind, such as the 250s, 230s, bolts right in there, and it is uh, super small, nice and light. Now, form factor, uh, it's designed around the new standard, which is the 36 mil versus the 45 mil, such as the, uh, the KKs and, and other flight controllers, the AIOs and all those. So it's the exact same bolt pattern and size as, say, like a NAS32 or a CC3D. Um, so you can actually get your flight controller and do a nice little power stack. So you've got flight controller, power distribution, uh, the holes line up on that. But it is rated at 50 amps, so it can handle a larger quad, say 450, 500 quad, absolutely no problem, or hex. All right, so let's talk about the layout on this. So you've got your two input powers right here, positive and negative, and around the outside and inside, you have eight available positive and negative, which means you could run hex and FPV, a quad, FPV, and a few other things. Um, it's just super small. It's a nice tight package, 50 amp capable. Uh, definitely check it out, especially if you're running on a smaller quad. It'll give you a real nice clean setup on that. Now, let's go ahead and talk about the other one, and this one I definitely like. Uh, this is the Quantum Power Distribution Board. It's rated at... 80 amps uh, as far as that is concerned, but you're going to notice two things on this. It has two integrated BECs built into it. Now, for you to use the BECs internal on this power distribution board, it's good up to 6S. Anything beyond that, the BECs uh, will not be able to handle the, uh, the voltage gel over heat. So basically, 80 amps, 6S input on this, and the two beaks on it. The reason it has two, one is set at 12 volts at 5 amp output, and we've measured these. They're super clean, so you can use them for FPV gear or any other type of gear. And the other one is variable between 3 volts and 20 volts on the output, so you can dial that right into 5 volts and supply your power for your flight controller or any other uh, uh, peripherals that you might have on your multi-rotor itself. And of course, it has provisions all the way up to an octo on this, as well as your FPV gear, uh, flight controller, and everything else on this. So definitely check these out. They're up on the new items page. It'll make your life a whole lot simpler and make your quad a whole lot cleaner. Check out these power distribution boards. As always, subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you next time.